Guys put some good at bats together in that game early, obviously, and uh, you know played pretty good defense at times. And so, uh, looking forward to tomorrow. I guess it'd be the easy way to, for me to answer that. Little had a stretch where he reached seven times in eight plate appearances. And Gabe Holt had a stretch where he reached six times in eight, six times in eight plate appearances. What you? I didn't. I didn't know that, but those guys can do that. Those guys, good offensive players, when when they're getting their pitch and they're separating balls and strikes, they can cause a lot of problems. And, uh, and both of them swing the bat a little bit. Both of them can run, and it's, it's going to be fun to watch those guys when they do that. Coach, start off today nine, you know, nine to one in the second game, and then three to zero in the first three games of the year. Has that been something you've been stressing as far as fast starts go and really trying to set the tone early? You know, we really talk about playing today and uh, showing up each day and preparing and, uh, you know, prepare the best you can, embrace the opportunity you have in front of you that day and count all that up when we're, you know, there's a, there's a time to count all that up right now. Talking about get some rest, get some food in you and get ready to go tomorrow and, I'll uh, put the work in and get ready to play. What happened with Gingrey? Uh, he had some discomfort and uh, just felt like it was the right thing to do to get him out of there. Where was he feeling it? In his arm. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 mean, I would say probably in the elbow area. Okay. Is that a, a big concern as that for considering his uh, – value to your importance. Oh, it's a concern. It's a concern because he's such a competitor and he wants to pitch. I mean, we, Dylan did a great job coming in and pitching, you know, after that. And, uh, we're fortunate we've got arms as far as that goes. It'll create an opportunity for other people. And, uh, but you want, you want what's best for Gingrey. He's put himself in a really good position this year and you want him to be able to go pitch for these guys. So, but you don't know enough. You have to say, no, we really don't know anything other than just got trying to take care of him. Is it anything that would call for an MRI or anything? Or? When a guy can pitch like that and they feel something, absolutely. Easiest way to answer that. Anything John pitched today? John was competitive. Uh, I thought he was, you know, I thought he got pretty efficient in the fourth and fifth. We were a little bit concern there going into the fourth trying to get him through the fifth and but was efficient and uh you know got through those two innings pretty clean and uh you know he located three pitches for strikes and uh, he's always going to compete and got you know he's just he's a competitor and and makeup and composure's there definitely got a couple of fresh make their first appearance on the mound today in the second game how do you think they did uh, well, you, you're grouping them up on me. I mean, I thought Kurt came in and got us out of a big jam there, even though it didn't seem like it. Uh, it was a jam. I mean, it was, you know, bases are loaded. doesn't really matter. You're trying to put up zeros every inning, trying to do the best you can. And I thought Kurt pitched really well. Uh, I thought Richard, Richard has really good stuff, just needs to trust the stuff, trust his body, go go do what he's always done, which is just, you know, fill up the strike zone. The uh, first inning of the second game where you hit the four home runs, were yeah. you worried about your bullpen getting tired with all the jumping? Yeah, up that's a, that there. could be a concern there, that's for sure. You're not going to see that every day, that's for sure. Uh, but the neat thing about baseball is every time you come to the ballpark, you're going to see something new usually. And that was something new, obviously. Uh, guys swung the back good, took advantage of, you know, some pitches in the middle of the plate, put some good swings on. You also had uh, some of those were opposite, what, three of those opposite field home runs? You'd have to help me out, like, who hit them. <laughs> I know Grant hit the first one, and I know Cam hit one, and then Michael hit one. So, yeah, two of the first three definitely were. And then who got in the who got in the act after that? Gabe was oh, Gabe was the first one. Yeah, so two of them were two pull side, two of them were oppo. There you go. You have four, they combined, your hitters had a combined 14 walks for the day. Did you feel like they were having good 
at bats. We or, we we did have good at bats. I mean, and that's something we try to we talk about quite a bit. Separating balls and strikes and getting your pitch and and uh, you know if if you got to take a walk, you got to take a walk and they'll give us free passes. That's always a good thing and. Uh, you know, I thought that was – it was a little bit better from yesterday, for sure. What you think of Harper now? Three innings with no hits. thought he was really – I didn't know he didn't give up a hit, but I thought he was sharp. thought he threw the ball well. thought he executed pitches. Stuff was good. Uh, fun to watch him pitch. You mentioned McMillan locating three pitches. He was working on a fastball changeup. Breaking ball. Yeah. He's Call it what you want. It's a hard breaking ball. I wouldn't call it a slider. Anything else? So with Stevens' issue, I mean, does that put a damper on the day for you? Does it put a damper on the yeah. day? Well, for yeah, absolutely. I mean, you definitely, uh, you know, every one of these guys is in a different spot. And right now, you know, he's in a spot where we got to, you know, make sure we're doing what's best for Steven and take care of Steven. And so it's like having one of your kids sick. I mean, you don't want them to be sick. I mean, obviously, you want him to be able to get out there and compete. You want him to feel good. And so obviously, uh, but if there was a lot of good in the day also. I, mean, I wouldn't want to take anything away from a lot of these guys. But I think, I think too, I think we all want to have him out there if we can have him out there. So is he a Steelers on one pitch? Because he only allowed one ball out of the infield before that. Was yeah, the stuff was good. Stuff was plenty good. Uh, I think, yeah, I think it was one pitch. I hadn't really asked him exactly. I just know he said, hey, come out there.